Sauce at an elegant backyard dinner party. Oh, that's crazy. Look, it's a spray of water raining over the fence. It's coming from a garden hose, apparently aimed by the next door neighbor, upset about the party noise. I'm videotaping the neighbor putting water on everyone. The guests try to speak to the neighbor over the fence. We're calling the cops. Several guests say they were completely drenched. He walked back, picked up a hose, and hosed me down while I was talking to him. The party's host is a physician, Dr. Eve Rosu. That's him when he became the first doctor in America to get a COVID vaccination in 2020. The dinner party took place at the doctor's home in Queens, New York. Guests included prominent figures in music, business, and law, but they never expected to be doused by water. This video was taken before the nine course dinner started. It was catered by Vanessa Kentov, Vanessa, who appeared on the Bravo TV show, Rocco's Dinner Party. Some of our guests had to drive home wet and humiliated. Now the hosts and their guests are suing the neighbor over what they say was a racially charged incident. Just about every guest was black. The neighbor, Marcus Rosebrock, is white. was a racially charged incident. Just about every guest was black. The name Right. So y'all think racism is over? Uh, yeah. Yeah. It's, 20, it's 2024. It's 2024. We all bleed red. We all bleed red. Trump running for president. Come on, man. You hear me? Trump running. Long as Trump is around, man, that should be your wake-up call. You hear me? <clears throat> Real talk. So like if I could real quick, <coughs> <coughs> not only just Trump, but you think Trump was the only one to think like that? Mm, mm, mm. He woke him up. Come on, man. He should have woke you up. <laughs> should have woke you up. Should have. These Come black on, people, now they supposed to be high value, up oh, ass looking on, right. <laughs> ain't having sex Doctor. with a bunch of women, Doctor. so the men... <laughs> Ain't gay <laughs> because the men don't have sex with a bunch of women. They Man. only got one woman they, they deal with they at a time. They monogamous. I mean, it is what it is, man. And they was at a party, and they got sprayed with a water hose by a white dude because he was jealous. He was mad. He was jealous because he seen black people having fun in 2024. So, so, so you mean to tell me that uh, n n n niggas ain't free to be niggas in 2024? Can't be, you know. You can't live in a white community and be a nigga at the same time? Nah. Because they're going to let you know that you still a nigga? Yeah, they're going to let you know with all the money you got. Oh, but I thought you was equal. Everything was equal. Everything, you know what I'm saying? Every, you you, 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 uh, you an American citizen. Mm-hmm. You got the same rights as they got. Yeah. Black is being black is no longer an excuse, right? Mm -hmm. Ah, yeah, it's rough. But you can't be black in a white neighborhood. Man, that you man. can you can't even be black and have a party in your backyard and the house that you paid for. But look, because your white neighbors is mad. What? He look like he smoked meth. <laughs> <laughs> he look like he lived in his mama basement. They 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 making it seem like he the homeowner. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised if this guy live in the basement and don't never come out unless the mom and daddy ain't there. And that's why he probably even did that shit. These people have no class. They taught you that you the one without the class. But really, it's them. These black people is having fun. Some of them have been on TV. And they there cooking. They got high top chefs cooking. And they got sprayed with a water hose because of the white man is the devil. Go ahead with that scripture, if so, I may. So, so you mean to tell me a nigga in 2024, uh, 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 a white man, his same counterpart is going to let him know that he's still a nigga in 2024. Yeah, go ahead with that scripture. Come on, come on. This is the book of Ecclesiasticus. And then the brother yeah. said he, he looked like he don't brush his teeth. <laughs> like it. He eat apples. <laughs> he, he eat apples. Apple a day ain't, ain't kept the meth away. <laughs> Yet. The apple a day ain't keep the mess away, Good and it night. is what it is. He probably ain't got no teeth to brush. <laughs> so like, Good night. That's why he's spraying the water hose. You feel me? Can we have a roasting session real quick? Get him. <laughs> you old Eminem looking ass nigga. Get him. You old trailer park ass nigga. Get him. You old I can't get out my mama basement because my credit fucked up ass nigga. Get
get him! <laughs> <laughs> Hell no. <nah. laughs> <laughs> it's the book of Ecclesiastes, chapter yeah, no. 12 and verse 10. Never trust thine enemy. Ne never trust thine enemy. That's the point. What you got to understand, neighbor or not, co-worker or not, business partner or not, never trust your enemy. Your enemy is somebody that don't look like you. Right. These white folks, these Asians, none of them, they don't trust you. So why the fuck do you trust them? Right. What they tell you, hurry up and buy. That's what they tell you. Get out of this neighborhood. That's what they tell you. But you're going to trust them. You're going to forgive and forget. You are an idiot, man. Never trust your enemy. For like as iron, so is his wickedness. So as iron rusts, so do his wickedness. There's the way iron rusts, soon as iron starts rusting, it's a done deal. Right. It's over with. Unless you got a, a welding machine, a saw, or something. And it is what it is. You go ahead. Come on, come on. Uh, verse 11. Though he, though, though he humble himself. Right, though he humble himself. Because that's what our oppressors is going to do. That's what the heathens are going to do to get your money. To try to get your money. They're going to humble themselves. They're going to pretend like they like you and they agree with what you've been through is wrong. And go crouching. Right, and go crouching. I mean, they lower themselves. They put themselves on your level. Yeah, take good heed and beware of take him. Take heed and beware of him. Beware. Like a dog. When you walk past a yard and you see a beware dog sign and you don't go right. in, even though you don't see the dog, that's how you got to treat our oppressors. That's how you got to treat the heathens. You have to be aware of them. Do not assume they're going to do the right thing because they're not. Come on, And thou shalt be unto him as if thou hast wiped a looking glass. Right, a looking glass is a mirror. And what we have done over the last 400 years, blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indians, we have stopped being the looking glass to the so-called white man. Now when the so-called white man see you, he feel like he freed you. He right. civilized you. He done right by you. When it was a time period when a white man saw you, he saw how he was the devil. Because you let him know. You reminded him. That's what a mirror is, is a reminder. And you're supposed to remind him every day that, nigga, you the devil. The Bible speaks of. You mean no good to this planet. That's right. You are a virus. Right. But for some reason, we have decided to stop being that reminder. You good? Okay. And thou shalt know that it, it's like it, thou shalt know that his trust has not been altogether wiped away. Right, his rust. That now that you know his rust have not been all wiped away. You hear me? This video right here is proof that his rust is not wiped away. These black people got money. They got top shelves from TV shows. All type of stuff at this party. And some white dude come out the basement, probably a meth head, sprayed them with water holes because they was playing too much ghetto music. Come on, man, stop. That's all I had on that. Okay, okay. All right, so yeah, we'll drop that and we'll go to the uh, last video.